Hello, hello, hello. What's up, Madlang people? Welcome back to VRB Podcast. And today's uh, topic is about reggae, uh, as requested by our friend Marjun Aquino. Sir, thank you for requesting this um, uh, tone patch. Right. Um, as you've heard on the intro, um, I only use reverb for that one and then an amp sim. Uh, that's my clean uh, clean tone patch uh, with the reverb, and I'm using the neck pickup. And then you can change the tone without even changing any patch by just going to your bridge. So if there's two guitarists. Maybe one can use the neck pickup so that it's more bassy. And then the other one can use the bridge pickup so that it's more uh, on the treble side. And then the timing can be changed as well. One can do the traditional re reggae, which is pop, pop, pop. And then the other one can do the pop. Up, up. And if they um, if they're played together, it sounds really amazing because the other one got the off beat. And then the other one is a little bit um, ahead of the other um, uh, guitar, so. Right. Um, to be honest, with reggae, normally it's more on the treble, and then the bass and the drums are the one that's doing uh, a very solid or like the bass of uh, the song, and then you got the color that's coming from either the keyboard or you're using some effects on your your guitar, but. Uh, you can normally hear the clean tone, so this one, which just rely on your own amp and put a bit of reverb if your amp got a uh, built-in reverb. And that will sound really a good reggae music. Now, uh, as I said, to add some more color to it, uh, what I noticed when I was uh, doing some reggae music before, uh, one that is really really good uh, to invest is an auto wah instead of a pedal wah uh, buy a pedal that is called auto wah and and that will sort the problem during our time we got uh, a group called the weed uh, who sang uh, the song long hair and there's an auto wah on that one and then the group uh, the youth and then they got the song Takbo. And there's an Ottawa as well on, on that song. Right, having said that, I got it here. I did uh, like uh, my own version of that wa. But it's more of what you call Vox wa. That I, I renamed it. I'll show it to you later. <laughs> Isn't it? It's 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 um, got a different tone now, different color to to the usual uh, reggae. And then, if you do lead with the Ottawa, it's really nice as well. And there's a, a reggae band or ska group as well who uses um, delay. So there's another um, effect that is really good to invest. Uh, the group 311 uh, normally use delay. And back home in the Philippines, uh, another group, rock group uh, called Urban Dub. They got delay as well. So 
yeah that's another uh, interesting one to to put as your effects but on the reggae itself i think they use analog or short delays and modern uh, ska or reggae or dub they call it um dub music they they put this long delay so it's also nice to experiment on that one and i hope we can try it out later or when i show you the effects here so we've got the ottawa and then this one um then overdrive that's another good uh pedal to invest um for reggae because when you do uh, solo or rock reggae uh, it's nice to have that uh like because the distortion is a bit too much it will be more on heavy rock but if you use overdrive i think it's it's, it's really good as well for for some reggae music uh, especially when you're doing your guitar solo it's not too upfront uh if you just use overdrive here's uh like a sample of delay Uh, so yeah, with the delay, it's a bit tricky. Uh, I think it's got to be two guitars. One is doing the clean uh, tone, uh, the traditional reggae, and then the other one is doing lead stuff that will uh, sort of um, add some more to the existing reggae rhythm.
something like that, guys. <laughs> um, pardon the playing there. Um, wasn't too prepared to to share about uh, the delay, but yeah, delay can be interesting to put in your reggae music. And then the other bit, um, I'm not sure if I still got it here. Um, let's find it. I think it's uh, I used to call it rake where you can let's do some uh, that one got like the amp itself the gain level was put up a little bit and then with um overdrive or a booster and that's another one that is really good uh to to put uh when you're doing reggae i hope uh, this helps uh, margin and then i will i will uh use another uh, angle or another camera to share to you the patches um the first one is just reverb and then the second one is Ottawa then we'll put the one with delay and the other one with overdrive actually with the delay and the overdrive they sort of come together as well so they I I, I got a separate patches but if you're using a pedal board then you can just turn on your delay turn on your overdrive turn it off when it's not needed but the basic is just an amp put some reverb if you got a uh, built-in reverb in your amp and then your guitar and then the tone knob and the uh, uh, pickup selector which one suits your sound and then that's it that's uh, pretty much uh, reggae uh, as long as you tweak the EQ or how you you strum it because if you look in here back to the uh, clean tone that's on the bridge and then back to the neck and then it depends on how uh, you like your reverb if it's not too much or if it's like this one it's a little bit um, prominent or some people if they don't opt for a reverb pedal they use an analog delay which they put it on a short uh, delay it's like a slap back delay uh, let's find it I think I, I've, I've seen one in here but it's hard because i can't memorize exactly what's inside this this is the one can you hear it the 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 delay there is so uh, quick so some people call it slap back uh, let's find some more if I, I got some more here but if not I think that one will do uh, I found it so this is the slap back the other one is pick chick so it's like chicken picking But this one is my tape slap. Right. Uh, now, now's the time to, to share to you the patches. So uh, bear with me and I'll put a camera pointing towards the effects pedal. And... We'll do that in a sec. Okay, so for our clean tone patch, uh, we've got this one. Uh, 
I or already got the uh, what pedal but we can ignore that one and the first one is the FD combo gain is very low it's only 10 then you got the tube up to 50 level 100 and then treble 48 and then uh, mid 45 and um, base 47 you can always adjust this one guys um, then presence 48 cab 1 by 12 output line and then obviously the reverb that I added to it is plate reverb and pred 9 decay 52 mix 44 color 58 low DMP 97 high DMP 95 tail off and level 100 so that's for the uh, clean tone uh, that's the first one that we did and then the oopsie daisy the Ottawa I'm using this one box that I created so the amp sim that we've used is tone city so gain 50 tube 30 level 100 treble 54 and mid 50 base 46 presence 52 and then the cab is tone city 4x12 output line and we got the cry this is like the auto wa range again nine resonance nine sensitivity six balance 90 level 100 and then next to it is again reverb um plate reverb pred 9 decay 12 mix 17 color 58 low dmp 97 high dmp 95 tail off level 100 so that's our Ottawa, but uh, I renamed it as Voxwa. And then the other bit that we've used was the delay, isn't it? So this is my killer delay. We've got the compressor, so opt comp, so drive 7, tone 54, and level 50. So it's got like an overdrive for this opt comp. And then we've used our amp sim as tangerine. So we got gain 20, tube 20, level 150, treble 50, and then mid 70, and then bass 45, and presence 50, cab tangerine 4 by 12, output line. And obviously the delay bit so we use carbon delay and delay is 440 regeneration 20 mix 100 modulation off with 31 speed 28 and then tail on and sync off so that's for our delay and i said earlier about the um the overdrive so i use their nashville so ignore this uh, wah pedal and we've got again a compressor for the first one sensitivity 2 tone 6 level 100 attack fast and then we got us uh, us blues so this is a uh, blues junior i think or something uh, amp which is like a fender gain 40 tube 46 level 116 treble 37 mid 48 base 42 presence 19 and us blues 4 by 10 for the cab and output line and then spring reverb that's our reverb so it's like the built-in reverb for your amp dwell 10 mixer 21 tone 24 level 100 so that's for like the overdrive setting or the blues uh, patch and what else did we do ah 
the slap back it's here tape slap so we got the tape echo but the settings for this time is 78 so it's very low feedback 31 is also low mix 75 and then high dmp5 level 100 tail off and then the next bit to that is your amp sim which is fd combo gain 24 tube 30 level 100 treble 48 mid 45 bass 44 presence 52 cab fd combo 2x12 and output line so that's the slap back uh, delay or tape slap uh, on this one and i think that's about it uh, those are the patches that we've tried on earlier and hopefully uh, this helps uh, you margin and uh, others who are watching this podcast again thank you for taking time and if you're new to my channel please subscribe and press that notification bell so you get notified each time i'm posting videos thank you for watching god bless see you again soon bye